Hey guys, it's me, Gloria. How we doing? Boy, I've been trying to do so many things today, and I finally got a chance to sit down and make this video. And it's really late right now. It's 9 p.m., so I figure I'll bring out this video really quick. Kind of try. <laughs> That's so funny. Try. <laughs> To uh, make this card really quick. So today I am using a free uh, silhouette cut that I am getting from Mrs. Kate's Cuttables. And um, if you guys don't know Mrs. Kate's Cuttables on her blog. She has one free SVG cut that you get for free every single day. So um, and it's whatever she chooses that's what the cut is. You can get it or you don't have to. But anyway, um, so, but, if you guys don't have the design, uh, the designer's edition, they have on the, uh, Silhouette store, the design number 54177, and this is the boy one. But if you want to make the exact one, all you have to do is put a bow on and vice versa, you know, turn, flip, flip it. So it'll look like the girl. That's it because it's the same entire image. The only thing is just flip the other way. And they're both holding a heart and doing whatever. Okay, so let's get started, guys. My card is going to be uh, a two size. No, not a two. Yeah, it's going to be a two size. It's going to be four and a quarter by 11. So now I'm going to score this at five and a half. So I hope everyone's having a really good time. Oh my God, this challenge is, the, uh, uh, the giveaway I'm having is, is amazing. Oh my God. Um, I, you know, I've been really busy. So yesterday was mail time, but I didn't get home till really late, late, late. So guys, I just want to let you know, I did receive two cards. And um, I am going to do a video after uh, I receive all the cards. So I end up receiving uh, uh, Marie Howie. Howsey. I think I'm pronouncing that right. And uh, Coach 718. Coach Nut 718. So I just want to let you guys know I did get two cards already. And I'm like so excited. And there's so many people that wanted to enter. I mean, it is so amazing, and I am so glad. And it's probably not even for the challenge. It's probably because of the goodies, but still, the more the merry. I don't care, you know. I, I like to have fun, and, you know, guys, I don't know. You you got to know me by now. I don't, I don't have too many people I do this with. Um... I've been so busy lately, I need to get a hold of my girlfriend. So, Linda, if you're watching, sweetheart, I miss you. I've just been so busy just doing everything. And, um, you know, I have to drive all the way to Brandon to my cousin's house. So, but anyway, there goes my card stock. Now, I already uh, did a couple of things already ahead of time. So, this is uh, four... A 4 by 5 and I'm going to hear it right there. Then I have these two pieces of paper that's going to go right on top of here. Just like that. And when I tape them down, then I have this border that I made. And I'm going to have it going upwards. So the color, the, the darker pink looks through. And that looks really good right there. And that punch is from... Martha Stewart, and um, it is called Lace Flowers, and it's a really, really pretty, pretty uh, punch. I really haven't used it. This is probably the first time, but, you know, there's always a time for everything. That's why sometimes I get things ahead of time. I might not use it right away, but I will use it because as I'm going along creating my cards, that's how I be. So let's adhere all of this down. So I hope you guys had a fabulous, fabulous Sunday. Obviously, the day is over. You know, it's 9 p.m. Well, it's 9.05 now. So, and there you go. I'm rambling. So let me stop talking so I could get this card done. But anyway, guys, I got a lot of people. And I will be doing another video um, 
on the challenge to making sure, you know. So, I can't wait to I get some French doors on my craft room. Guys, here in Florida, we have a back room, and they are called Florida rooms. And what it is, is just a room with minimized walls, and is all windows. So, I really don't have a lot of hanging space, but it is sure a hell of a lot better than the corner I was in. So, <laughs> and I'm just going to kind of... Just like that. Oh, yes. And I'm just going to adhere this. Now, I'm starting to think. No, I'm going to leave it just like that. Just like that. Okay. So, guys, I want to thank everyone that is joining my challenge. It's amazing. Today, I had woke up really early, and I tackled my bathroom. I went through my makeup drawer, my medicine cabinet. Oh, my God. I threw out so much stuff. And it's not like that it's been there for three, four, five years. You know, this was only from last year's stuff. And I said, no, I need to get rid of it. And then I end up punching on the same pattern paper. The pattern paper is double-sided, so as you can see, I end up using my Friskus Heart Punch. So now I'm just going to add these two down there, just like that, just to give it a little accent. I did it on the wrong side. Okay. Well, that always happens. Thank God I got a spare. So, I also already stamped Happy Valentine's Day, and I end up using my uh, Scrappy Mom stamp set called Love Notes, and I use two stamps off of here. I use My Heart Belongs to You, and I use my Happy Valentine's Day. And I stamp that with my stays on to give it a vibrant color. And I actually need to get me a new stays on pad because mine suck. Even I bought the refill bottles, and it still is sticky. And it, it gets stuck to the paper, and when you think you got it printed on, and you, you know, you pressed on it hard enough, it ain't hard enough. Okay. And then, I have these two small, really small, white hearts that I'm just gonna adhere down. I just gotta find out what side, because I think this was from the glossy paper. Okay, I got it on the right side. And I'm going to do the same with this one. And that one is just going to go right here okay and I thought I had one more but I don't but that's all right guys okay so let's start decorating the front of the card okay now for the front of the card I already stamped my sentiment my heart belongs to you so I got this pink cardstock and this is beautiful I love it I definitely love this color I just picked this up the other day from Tuesday morning 
Um, um, yeah, from Tuesday morning. So, guys, today they had a major sale. But I got my hands on some a little bit earlier this week. So, okay, so I'm going to hear all of these together. Now, you see this black paper? Oh, it's making me sick. I don't know if type of colors like this make you sick, but they sure turn my stomach. Okay, so now I'm just going to... I wanted to make a cheesecake this weekend and record it, but I didn't have no time. So I might be thinking about doing that really, really soon. Because I love me some homemade cheesecake, especially the recipe that I got is so nice and creamy. Okay, and then I'm just going to adhere these three layers to the front of my card. And now I'm just going to pop it right here, if I can, straight dab in the middle, just like this. Oh, I got a new phrase, it's just like this, no. <laughs> and then I got these two strips, of course, you know, me and my strips, I gotta find another. But I just like it, there's just something about it, so I'm just gonna adhere these right down so I'm gonna add this to the middle so guys oh I want to show you something and you know I'm so upset too not really, I'm not upset. But, you know, I'm, to me, this is a big deal. But obviously, I don't think my son think it is. So just give me a second, guys. My mom had to call me today and says, Gloria, I was reading the newspaper and guess who's in it? And I says, who's in it? She said, your son. I said, no, he ain't. What he doing in the newspaper? He would have told me something like that, right? Oh, no. He didn't mention anything. Okay. So I called my husband and because I wasn't home when my mom called me. So I called my husband and here goes the article. So I called my husband and I says, baby, I asked Christian if, if he knows if he's in the newspaper. And then his response was, oh, um, oh, I forgot. So, this is a, a article of where his middle school's at. And it says, working the cameras during a recent broadcast are Phoenix Miller, 13, on the left, which is this young girl, and then Christian Cologne, 14. Getting the morning news on the air in order for business for middle golf middle school students in Dennis uh, Martin broadcast class. So I was so stinking happy. I just could not believe it at all. So there goes my son right there. There goes the article. And he's in the newspaper. Yay! <laughs> I'm so excited for that. But anyway, guys, let me stop. Okay, now for let's do this because I already trimmed off the rest. So now I'm just going to add this down. And I want to put this right 
right there. Okay, and then I have some of these hearts that I just like dropped all over the floor. And I'm just going to throw them around on the top. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to leave them all down. And I'm going to take my zip two-way. I'm going to flip that one over. So, I mean, my son, he was not even excited about it at all. But he does the morning news in his school and he films it. So, it's actually a really good achievement. But I want him to learn how to edit so he can help me. But I really don't want to edit because then I'll edit everything I'm talking. And that will be a long time to edit because I pro probably want to have let you hear everything I say. <laughs> Okay, guys, so now I'm just going to adhere these hearts randomly. If I could get it off my finger. And that one, I will have to probably... Put some... Oops, some glossy accents to cover the, the glue. Because it'll dry, but it'll, you'll still see. Okay, and let me move this one the other way. Okay. And what I'll do, I'll put some glossy accents on that. And you won't even be able to tell the difference. Okay. So now for my image, here goes my monster. Oh my god. I popped up her eyes so she looked much better. And I glossy accents her bowl and then I use some prima flowers and I put a prima flower in the middle and then um gem so there goes my cut and I think she came out so stinking cute she came out adorable and the I use glossy black card cardstock so her eyes look glossy and then I did the white glossy paper too so it came out really cute so I'm just gonna adhere her right there in the middle but she's going to go a little bit further up. And I already got her on some pop dots. I mean foam tape. So I'm just going to take this off. And I'm just going to drop her right about here. Like there. Okay. And now I have a heart to go right in between her hands. But I want to put this on some foam tape. So let me get a piece out. I think she came out so cute. And so stinking ugly. She's a monster. <laughs> That's the cute part of it. That's what makes it so cute. You know? Okay, I might want to pop this up twice. So what I did, I took some hearts and I just layered them all up on top of each other. Yeah, I need, I need a... Okay, just give me a second. I'm almost done. Oh, 
Okay. So there goes my card, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate everyone that leaves comments. Sweet, awesome comments at that. And I just love to share with you guys, you know. You're my friend. You're, you're my family. And I appreciate it, guys. So thank you so much for watching. You guys have a marvelous evening. And I'll come back soon. I'll talk to you later. I am going to do another video about the challenge. You know, I try to kind of keep up to date. But there goes my card, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And there goes the inside. Have a good evening. Bye.